we are asked to find the equation that represents this line. And the easiest type of equation to find out based on just being given a line is an equation in the in slope intercept form, which is y is equal to mx plus b, where m is the slope, where m is the slope, and b is the y intercept the y value of the coordinate where our graph intersects the y axis. So the y intercept is very easy to find. We can actually figure it out just by inspecting our graph. We intersect the y axis, that's the y axis right there, it wasn't labeled, right there at the point x is equal to 0. x is always going to be equal to 0 at the y axis. So x is equal to 0, y is equal to 3. So our y intercept is 3. And it makes complete sense. If x is equal to 0, y is equal to 3. So b is equal to 3. Now the next thing we need to do is figure out the slope of this line. Figure out what m is going to be equal to. And remember, slope, slope, which is the same thing as our m, or what m is represents, that is our change in y for a given change in x. So let's go from this point to some other point that where we can definitely figure out its coordinate. So that looks like a nice integer coordinate right there. And let's figure out what our change in y and our change in x was to get there. So to our change in x, we're starting here at x is equal to 0. We're moving in the positive x direction by 5. So our change in x, our change in x is equal to 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We went from x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 5. So our change in x is equal to 5. That's our change in x. Now what's our change in y? Well, we have to go down 2. We have to go down 2. So our change in y, when our change in x is positive 5, our change in y is negative 2. Our change in y is negative 2. We're going down. We're decreasing in y. So our change in y is negative 2. So our slope is negative 2 fifths. So we figured out the slope. We figured out the y-intercept. We can now write the equation that represents this line. It is y is equal to this character, negative 2 fifths times x. That's m right there plus b. b is 3, plus 3. And we are done.